Hi everybody, it's Tiffany Rochelle. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Okay, I know I've been gone for a while. Um, I have so much to talk about. Oh my gosh, how... Yeah, I know how I was doing the little keto thing. Yeah, I kind of stopped because I um, my body rejected it. But anyways, I'm in a different setting. Obviously, you guys see that this is not my background. This is nothing new. Um, just want to let you guys know I finally moved into my own place. I have my own little place now. Um, excuse my hair. I just took it down because I just got off of work. So, um, yeah, I look crazy. Anyways, I moved into my own place finally. And um, it's my own little studio. And I'm not downtown no more. Um, so, I'm very excited about this. I'm happy. Um, I would give you a little tour of it. But, obviously, it's just a studio. So, it's nothing special. It's just one big space obviously so when i get it together i'll finally um show you guys how it look and everything um so what's been going on with tiffany well tiffany's just been working tiffany got a better job tiffany is happy in her life tiffany is striving and tiffany will be back with videos more and um I have some um, some makeup, so I'm waiting for that. I'm not going to get it before Christmas, um, so it might come a little after Christmas, which is fine with me, whatever. It's still my Christmas gift to myself, um, so when uh, those makeup products come in, because I do have one makeup, I have my um, Juvia's Place um, little makeup foundation thing. So once I get my other box that's supposed to be coming in, then I'm going to do a whole look. So I'm super excited. I got it during um, the Cyber Monday, obviously, from, you know, Black Friday. So I'm happy. It's a whole bunch of little um, eyeshadows and stuff. So I can't wait for you guys to see it. And I'm, I'll do a little unboxing and everything. It's going to be dope. Um, What else? But yeah, like I said, I'm not on keto no more, but I am planning on um what's it called just doing a low carb diet really um not too extreme to where i'm in you know doing keto my body obviously didn't you know respond well to it so it's a whole mess like i had to go to the hospital i was sick whatever whatever you know so on and so forth and you know i don't really want to get into it but um other than that i'm fine i'm here i have gained my little weight back that i lost but that's fine um, cause I'm about to start something completely different and I can't wait. Obviously I'm, I'm so hyped up to it and, um, you know, I'm doing well in my life. So I'm super happy. I'm happier in my situation. I'm happier where I'm at, you know, six months ago, um, I really didn't know what I was going to do with my life. I didn't know where I was going to live. I didn't know. It's so much that happened within, you know, the past six months to now, you know, so I'm super blessed and I'm super happy and I can't wait to rejuvenate my um, my channel. I'm I'm so happy. Oh, my gosh. I look a hot mess. Look at this. Whatever these you guys remember when I cut my bangs? They're so long now. They're like they're so, so long. But anyways, um, this is just a quick little what's it called? Like a. I'm having a brain fart. <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm watching Chris Zone's best. My bed is full of stuff right now. And once I really get my little studio together, I'll probably do like a quick little circle around. You know, it's not it's not too big, but it's not too small. It's perfect for me. It's just me by myself. I don't have no kids. I don't have no animals or nothing. So I enjoy it a lot and I'm happy that I'm here. So I will see you guys soon soon so probably the next time i come back on here is when i actually have my makeup so that way i could do a little unboxing of my makeup and probably play around with it and have like a little let's play my makeup tester i don't know i think of something <laughs> but um you guys have a 
good evening and i will talk to you later bye that was ugly hi guys i know i was gonna end the vlog but i just feel like i'm not finished talking so i'm back um you guys might think that it's been probably the same day but no this is like what sunday it's been like three days now so uh, yes i'm in my bed um i'm a little snuggled up right now because you know i'm just it's sunday and it's one of them days and you know i just want to be in my you know just sitting here i have the tv on mute but i'm watching tv my heater i need to turn my heater on because um it's a little chilly but you know i have my little blanket so well it's not a little but i have my blankie so anyways um i'm not really finished talking like i feel like i still need to continue to talk um because even though I said like, oh, this is what Tiffany's been up to, like, I still have some things that I'm really in the works of. Um, I did obviously tell you guys before that I just moved to my place. So obviously I'm trying to get this here together slowly but surely. But I've decided this past week, um, like early, well, not even, it's probably been like a week or two. I don't know. It's either one of those. But um, I've decided that. I want to practice self-love. What is self-love? To me, self-love is loving yourself, getting all the energy, all the bad energy, not all energy, but all the bad energy away, being positive with yourself, loving yourself, giving yourself positive affirmation, just, you know, loving yourself unconditionally that nobody else could basically and that's everything that means i want to love my body inside and out so like i told you guys before i am going to start a low carb diet not keto but low carb it's still going to be the same you know same specifics it's loving yourself inside out exercising working out putting what's well, the same thing um eating healthier um, you know, just being happy with your life, buying the things that you want, buying, you know, the little shirt that in the back of your mind is telling yourself, no, because you still have that. I need to save money mentality. I mean, it's good to still have that mentality, obviously, but obviously I came from, I'm, I've been broke. So, you know, my mind, my whole mindset is completely different. Like I will not buy anything because in my mind, I'm always thinking, well, I could use that for a bill or I need that for something else or whatever, so on and so forth. So I need to cut that out because now that I'm like, you know, doing good, you know, I can be able to buy whatever I want. I just still have that mentality from when I was, you know, broke that, no, don't spend this. Don't spend that. You know, you can get something that whatever, whatever. Have that mentality. Um, what else? loving yourself it's just being able to not be around the people that's not there for you easily cutting people off easily taking away all that negative energy just being in love with yourself basically you know um not wasting time on people that's not really there for you but you know that's kind of fake in your life i've been through so much in my life that i'm at a point to where you know, I'm happy. Don't get me wrong. I'm very happy. I'm lonely, but it is what it is. I cut out a lot of things in my life. And that is the reason why I'm here to this day where I'm at in my life. You know, um, like I said, six months ago, I didn't know what I was going to be doing or anything. Six months ago, I was depressed. Six months ago, I just felt like nobody was there for me. Nobody didn't care about me. Six months ago, I had a hard time, you know, accepting myself and loving myself. You know, I've always, I've always been a plus size girl. I've always been chubby, you know, and I've never accepted it and I never loved myself for it. And so that put me in a little shell and a little box, you know, and I, I tend to stay away from people and I tend to shut down around people. I tend to not talk to people and it's like, it's not, and people will, people think that, you know, 
I'm mean or I don't like somebody because I don't really open up and that's not the case it's just because of my past and what I've been through makes me not want to open up and talk to people and so if I feel like there's any type of confrontation or anything that's coming my way I um I tend to shut down but now I'm at a point where I like I don't want to shut down I don't want you know I just if there's any issues or whatever let's talk it out whatever um you know, I only have a few friends. I really don't have a lot of friends. That's, I can truly say are my friends. I have, you know, a few and there's only a couple that I consider family. So, um, and you guys know who you are. I mean, I talk to you guys all the time. So, um, I've been through a lot and, you know, and even with one of my true, true friends and, you know, I, you know, he's my heart dearly because I, I truly, is that a spider? Mm, I hope not. But anyways, because I don't feel like killing it. But um, one of my good friends is always encouraging me in trying. And I see it. And, you know, I'm just, I'm so thankful for it. And, you know, I've been through depressions. And being in depression is not a good thing. And it's so hard to pull yourself out of being depressed. So, um, I'm thankful that I'm not there no more and just self-love is just loving yourself, having fun, just doing the things you want to do, going out, taking yourself out on dates, buying that extra piece of socks that you want. I don't know. It's just the more I go through it, the more I accept it because for a long time, I haven't accepted myself for a long time. I've been self-conscious for a long time. I've been depressed about myself. You know, I always thought that I wasn't pretty. I always thought that, you know, I'm just this fat girl, you know. And it, it kept me quiet and in the shell. So hopefully I want to break out of that shell. I have the, the biggest wall around me. I have the biggest wall around my heart. I don't let people in. So um, I'm going to try to start practicing self-love. I mean, this is what I'm getting for it as far as me thinking it. But I also need to really research it, you know, because there's so much that you that goes on to your self-love. And hopefully you guys will be along with me. You know, I do plan on vlogging again. I do plan on vlogging again and doing everything again like I was. My little healthy food and everything. Right now I'm just chilling. You know, it's the end of the year. And honestly, the beginning of this year was so fucked for me. Excuse my language. The beginning of this year, the end of last year was so hard on me. And then the middle of the year it got a little better because, you know, I just I had to get out of something. But then it's like now I'm in a good place and I'm happy. I'm happier. I'm so much happier. And even my friend told me he was like you sound happier you like you just sound different i yeah it's because i feel different i'm happier i'm at peace i'm so thankful that i'm in my own place now i don't have to worry about anybody or anything and it's just so much that went on but i'm so so happy in my life right now and i'm so glad that i would love to share you guys with this um with this i would love for you guys to you know be with me to you know to to the beginnings of all beginnings you know because you know there's a lot in my life right now I'm so happy in my life I mean I wish I had more you know like I said you know I'm kind of lonely I do get so lonely you know it's like I'm lonely but it is what it is you know I don't have no kids or anything so I do get lonely here a lot and um I think that's why that was so country I think that's why I just want to really change myself because, you know, I just want to do something for me. I do feel lonely, but also I want to make myself happy. So I'm going to get happier. I'm happy, but I want to be happier in my life and take this journey with me. Um, I'm going to continue with my vlogs again. I'm going to continue doing my makeup. I'm going to continue with my weight loss. I'm going to continue with all that. Nothing's going to change. I'm still going to be Tiffany, but I'm just going to add self-love with it as well. Some positive affirmations, loving yourself. You know, I think I'm going to start, I don't know, I might start some fashion up in here. You know, I might just throw on some 
you know, throw some stuff on that I like. My fashion sense is super different. Um, I'm girly, girly, but I am kind of a bum tomboy. <laughs> so, I don't know. We'll see. Um, I really don't have nothing else to talk about. I just wanted to get on here. I'm going to finish watching TV, and I think that's a spider by my sink, so I think I need to go and kill that sucker. Anyway, again, I'll see you later. Bye.